It's almost midnight. Ryan's been grinding on a video edit for hours. The title's Fire. The hook, Chef's Kiss. But the thumbnail? Why do I need a degree in visual sorcery just to crop my own face? We've all been there. Photoshop nightmares, Canva burnout, and a thumbnail that still looks like it was made during lunch break in high school. But that ends today, because in the next few minutes, you're gonna learn how to take any thumbnail style, Miss Beast, Air Rack, Jubilee, you name it, swap out their face with yours, tweak the text, and make it completely your own. No design skills, no subscriptions, just AI. Before we dive into the actual steps, let's talk about why this hack is so powerful. Thumbnails matter a lot on YouTube. They're like the cover of a book. If it looks boring, nobody wants to click. But if it looks amazing, people rush to check out your video. The problem is, not everyone has hours to spend learning Photoshop or the money to hire professional designers. I know that because I am one of them. That's where AI comes in. By uploading a couple of images and typing a short prompt, you can get thumbnails that rival the biggest channels out there. Want to copy Missa Beast's bright colors and crazy expressions? You can. Want to appear in a scene with 50 other YouTubers? Fight for $1,000? Done. And you don't even need advanced editing skills. Just follow these steps. Understanding how the face swap hack works. First and foremost, we're using an AI model that can analyze images, understand what's in them, and then generate a brand new version of those images with whatever changes you'd like. Although it might sound really high tech, by the end of this tutorial, you'll see just how straightforward it can be. Now let's take a look at the three main ways to swap faces using ChatGPT4. OpenAI's image generation feature. This is similar to ChatGPT, but for pictures. Instead of typing text and getting text back, we'll type a prompt and let the AI edit or create images based on our instructions. Uploading images. We'll be uploading two images. One is the original thumbnail you want to imitate, and the other is a selfie or any photo of you, of you that you want to use in place of the original face. Combining the images, the AI will look at your selfie, look at the original thumbnail, and literally swap out the face. Now, before we swap any faces, we need to get into the right tool. You can do this if you have access to ChatGPT's new image generation model or a similar AI that can handle images. Log into ChatGPT. Make sure you're using the version that supports image uploads. Different subscription plans sometimes have limits. If you're on the free tier, you might only get a few image generations per day because the tool is super popular and can be slow at times. If you're on the pro plan, you'll have more freedom to run multiple generations. Click to start a new chat or a new conversation. You'll see a little plus icon or an upload button. That's where you'll provide the images. Plan your prompt. Your prompt is the instruction you give the AI. This is where you'll say something like, replace the face in the thumbnail with my face and keep everything else the same. The AI needs to know exactly what to do. Finding the thumbnail you want to imitate. Now it's showtime. Let's say you found a really cool thumbnail from Miss a Beast or from any other YouTuber you love. Maybe you like the bold text and the bright colors and you think swapping in your face would help catch people's attention on your own channel. Google the title. Let's pretend the video is called I Survived Five Deadliest Places on Earth. You can open YouTube and take a screenshot of the thumbnail or you can copy the video title and search for it in Google Images. Download the thumbnail. Once you find it, right-click and select Save Image As. This will save the thumbnail to your computer. Make sure you remember where you saved it so you can upload it easily. Uploading your own face. Now we need a picture of you or whoever you want to put into the thumbnail. Choose your best selfie. You want a clear photo of your face. It doesn't need to be a fancy portrait. Even a quick selfie should do just fine. The key is that your face is clearly visible and not too blurry. In the same chat with the AI model, you can click the plus icon or upload button and select your selfie. Wait a moment for it to upload. Here's where you'll tell the AI exactly what you want to do. Think of your prompt like giving instructions to a friend who's helping you design the thumbnail. Here are some basic prompt templates you can use. Replace the face in thumbnail PNG with the face in selfie NG. Keep the background, text, and other elements the same. If you want to change the background color or tweak the text, mention that too. For example, replace the face in thumbnail with the face in selfie NG. Change the text from I survived five deadliest places to my epic survival challenge in a bold white font. Keep the background color bright green. If the first result comes back in the wrong size or your text gets cut off, instruct the AI. Keep the aspect ratio the same as the original thumbnail, 1920 by 1080. Don't crop out the text. 
Don't worry if it sounds a bit robotic. The AI thrives on direct, specific instructions. After you hit enter, the AI needs a little time to work its magic. It will analyze both images, your selfie and the thumbnail, and figure out the best way to merge them. What the AI does, it looks at your face in the selfie, like the shape of your eyes, the angle of your cheeks, your nose, everything, and replaces the original face in the thumbnail. If you ask for color or text changes, it applies those too. Sometimes, this can take a minute. If the servers are overloaded, you may have to wait longer. Go grab a snack or do a quick stretch break. Once the new image is generated, it'll appear on your screen. Don't be discouraged if it looks a bit off the first time. Maybe your face is slightly squished or the text shifted to a weird spot. That's normal. The biggest key to getting the perfect thumbnail is to keep refining. If the first image is close but not perfect, try these adjustments. For example, if your face looks too stretched, tell the AI, make the face proportionate to the body. Adjust the lighting so my face matches the original thumbnail's lighting. If the words are too small or cut off, specify, increase the size of the text by 20% and move it slightly to the left so it's not covered by my face. Don't be afraid to ask for multiple variations. You could say, give me three different styles of the thumbnail with my face swapped in, each with different background colors. Experimentation is the name of the game. Sometimes the best thumbnail is the third or fourth version. Now you might be thinking, isn't copying other people's thumbnails kind of risky? Good point. Here are some things to keep in mind. Fair use. If you're only using someone else's design for educational or experimental purposes, it might be okay, but if you plan to put it out there on your own channel, definitely make enough changes so it's your original creation, not a direct copy. Transformation. AI can drastically change the image, which can sometimes count as transformative use, but it's still good practice to be creative and add your own twist, like swapping the colors, changing text, or rearranging elements. Respect. If a thumbnail is super distinctive or iconic, you could be stepping on someone's creative rights. Always consider how you'd feel if someone else used your own custom design without permission. Once you're happy with the new image, download it from the AI tool. It'll likely save as a PNG or JPG file. There you have it, folks. A complete step-by-step -step guide to swapping faces in a thumbnail without using Photoshop. With a few simple uploads and the right AI prompts, you can create designs that grab attention and make people want to click on your videos. Now you have a quick and easy way to test multiple designs, stand out on people's feeds, and really showcase your creativity. If you found this tutorial helpful, please give this video a thumbs up and infamous fang. Don't forget to subscribe for more AI tips, thumbnail hacks, and all sorts of clever tricks to grow your channel faster.